The lion is one of the large predatory animals belonging to the feline family. There are several varieties of this animal, in addition, there are many hybrids that have appeared as a result of mixing of different species. Each of them has some peculiarities, but also some similarities. The local population of the lands, which are placed near the habitat of the animal, calls it a wild cat and considers it dangerous and tries to destroy it. Because of this, the population of these animals is greatly reduced. Meanwhile, the lion is an interesting and peculiar animal, so it is worth knowing how it differs from other representatives of fauna. The lion characteristics and description when characterizing such an animal as the lion, it is necessary to provide its description. Different species are slightly different from each other, but they have a lot in common. The animal belongs to the feline family, so in its appearance is similar to domestic cats, only greatly exceeding them in size. It is one of the largest members of this family, second only to the tiger. The body of the beast is flexible and agile, and they have well-developed muscles in their front paws and neck. Its paws are equipped with claws that are up to 7 centimeters long. His head is large, with an elongated muzzle and strong jaws. His fangs are long, about 8 centimeters, and have 30 teeth. These features enable the lion to hunt large herbivores. The tongue is covered with tubercles, thanks to which the lion can clean its fur from dirt and remove insects. On the muzzle are whiskers, at the base of which there are small dark spots. These spots form a pattern unique to each animal. Babies come into the world spotted, but as they get older, the spots disappear from their bodies and the color of their fur becomes uniform, either brown or sandy. The animal has a black tassel on the tip of its tail. The main feature of this species is sexual dimorphism. The male and female lioness have significant differences. For example, it is impossible to say how much a lion weighs on average without knowing the sex of a particular individual. Males greatly outnumber females in size and weight. In addition, their head is decorated with a mane, which begins to grow in lions at the age of six months. The length of the hair and the thickness of the mane depend on age and genetics. How much does a lion weigh? How much an adult lion weighs on average depends on the peculiarities of his life. But especially the gender affects this figure. Males, body length 1.7 to 2.5 m, weight 150 to 250 kilograms, shoulder height approximate 1.2 m, tail length 0.9 to 1.05 m, females, body length 1.4 to 1.45 m, weight 120 to 180 kilograms, shoulder height approximate 1.07 m, tail length 0.7 to 1 m. Despite its massive size, this predator has the smallest heart size. Therefore, the lion cannot be called endurance. It can reach speeds of up to 80 km per hour, but it can only cover short distances. Features of life and habitat When giving a description of any animal, it is necessary to consider not only its appearance. It is also worth finding out how long the lion lives and where it lives. There are few places where such an animal as the lion lives. In recent years, the range of its distribution has decreased significantly. Previously, this animal was found not only in Africa and India, as it is now, but also in Iran, Russia, Southern Europe, and the Middle East. But a large part of the population has been exterminated, and the conditions in many areas have become unsuitable for their life. Therefore, of all the places where these animals used to be seen, the lion now lives only in the southern part of the African continent, beyond the Sahara Desert, and in the Indian state of Gujarat. Savannas, forests, or scrublands are the most suitable habitats for them. The individuals are grouped into small flocks prides. The pride consists of five or six females, between which there is a kinship relationship, their cubs and the male. In some pride there may be two males if they are brothers. The young males, when they reach maturity, leave the pride, they are expelled. They have the opportunity to join another pride or create their own. Some of them lead a solitary life. What does the lion eat? How much a male or female lion weighs depends on their eating habits. Since the lion is a predator, he leads a hunting life, eating quite large animals. These can be deer, wild boar, antelope, zebra, buffalo, giraffe, and livestock. 
In rare cases, the animal may attack a hippo or a small elephant. Cheetahs, hyenas, and leopards may also fall prey to it. The lionesses excel at hunting. They are noted for their agility and dexterity. Males are more difficult to hunt because of their large size and heavy mane. But males need more food. An adult lion eats about 7 kilograms of meat in a day, while a female lion needs only 5 kilograms. These animals prefer to hunt at night, sneaking up on their prey at the maximum distance. Breeding lions Breeding in lions is not tied to the time of year, and it begins with the achievement of maturity. Males are considered sexually mature at the age of 6 years and females at the age of 4 years. Males tend to fight for females. Sometimes these fights are so fierce that the competitor dies. The gestation period for these animals is 110 days. Shortly before giving birth, the lioness leaves the pride and hides. She can give birth to one to four cubs that weigh a little less than two kilograms. The cubs are born blind and do not open their eyes until seven days after birth. For safety reasons, the mother changes her place of residence several times, carrying her cubs behind her. She hunts and feeds the cubs with milk. The cubs learn to hunt at the age of 1.5 months, at which time the whole family joins the pride. When the hunt begins, the cubs eat meat little by little, although the period of milk feeding lasts about six months. Longevity of the lion One important aspect of describing these animals is the question of how long a lion lives. To answer it, we need to take into account very many circumstances. How long a lion lives depends on such features as habitat. The better the living conditions, the greater its duration. Proximity to people. Close proximity to humans increases the risk of extermination of these animals and shortening their lives. Peculiarities of life. Solitary individuals live shorter lives than those belonging to the pride. Sex. Females on average live longer than males because they are less likely to die during fights with other lions. All these nuances affect how long a lion lives. Therefore, their lifespan varies greatly. On average, it is 8 to 10 years. Some individuals live up to 14 years. How long a lion lives is greatly influenced by human behavior. It has much more influence than other factors. If people do not seek to destroy these animals, their longevity increases. Better results can be achieved by organizing suitable living conditions for the animals, such as nature reserves or zoos. In this case the lions may live for 20 or even 25 years, as they are supervised by veterinarians. Types of lions How long a lion lives also depends on the species of this animal. There are several subspecies of lion, each of which differs in certain features, habitat, living conditions, and its duration. Some subspecies of this animal are already extinct, others are in the process of extinction. There are also several hybrid species that appeared as a result of crossing with tigers, leopards, or jaguars. Asiatic lion scientists distinguish eight main subspecies, one of which is the Asiatic lion. Another subspecies name is the Persian lion or Indian lion. The Asiatic lion lives in the southern part of Eurasia. Its main habitat is the Gur Reserve in the Indian state of Gujarat. The Asiatic lion is considered an endangered species. This subspecies is characterized by its stockiness. Males are slightly more than one meter in height. Because of the sleek and sparse mane, the Asiatic lion does not seem as large as the representatives of the African subspecies. Male body weight from 160 to 190 kilograms, lioness usually weighs 90 to 120 kilograms. Body length 2 to 2.5 m. The largest Asiatic lion is 2.92 m long. African lion. The other species are found in Africa, so they can all be classified as subspecies of African lion. They are characterized by certain common features, such as sexual dimorphism, for color, peculiarities of life and breeding, and so on. Differences may be in size and body weight. Berberian. This subspecies is the largest. It used to spread throughout the African continent, but has now been completely exterminated. 
Males weighed up to 270 kilograms and females up to 170 kilograms. Nowadays in zoos and nature reserves one can see descendants of these animals, but it is impossible to call them purebreds. Senegalese. This too, is an African lion that lives in the west of the continent. The size of these animals is small and their hair color is light. Males have almost no mane, or it is very short. Representatives of this subspecies can be found in Nigeria, Guinea, and Senegal. Senegalese lions are considered endangered. The North Congolese. It possesses all the external features of the African lion. Its habitat is the savannas of northeastern Congo. The population of these animals is gradually declining. Maasai. Otherwise it is called the East African lion. It differs from other species by its longer paws. Their mane is directed backward. Male body length is 2.5 to 3 m and female body length is 2.3 to 2.6 m. These animals inhabit Uganda, Zambia and Mozambique. A large number of Maasai lions are kept in the Maasai Mara Reserve in Kenya. Katanga. This species is on the brink of extinction. Its main mass is found in Southwest Africa, Zimbabwe, Angola. Adult males reach 3.1 m in length and females 2.65 m, Transvaal. These are lions with black manes. Among the representatives of this subspecies, there are individuals whose skin and coat have no melanocytes. Because of this, they have a white coat and pink skin. The length of a lion can be from 2.6 to 3.2 m, the lion is 2.35 to 2.65 m. Transvaal lions live in southern Africa, the Kalahari Desert. They are also kept in the Kruger National Park. Cape Lion. This species was exterminated in the 19th century. They inhabited the Cape of Good Hope, southern Africa. The peculiarity of the species was the black tips of the ears and the presence of a mane on the belly and shoulders. This classification is not the only one. There are others to which scientists may add other subspecies. Interesting varieties noteworthy is such a variety of these animals as the mountain lion. He is not very similar to his other congeners, differs in size and area of habitat. The mountain lion is widespread in the territory of America. Its body is 1 to 1.8 m long and can weigh up to 105 kilograms. This is significantly less than the other subspecies. Also, the mountain lion has no mane. Coloration can vary from gray-brown to brown-yellow. Cougar cubs are born with dark spots and stripes on the body, but after nine months of life, these marks begin to fade. The mountain lion prefers to live alone. The exception is the mating period and the time of rearing the cubs. Another subspecies that may be of interest is the cave lion. It is included in some classifications despite the fact that the cave lion is an extinct species with extinction several millennia ago. When alive, these animals inhabited Siberia and Europe. The cave lion is one of the progenitors of the modern lions. The cave lion was larger in size than its descendants. If we believe the images of these animals, they had no mane, or it was very small. It is unknown exactly, but there is speculation that this subspecies of animals was also united into prides. Despite the name, the cave lion never lived in caves. They were chosen by old and sick individuals shortly before death, which is why most of the remains of these animals have been found there. That is why the cave lion was so named. The cave lion hunted deer and bears. This scientists explain the extinction of these animals. With the onset of warming the number of bears and deer decreased, and the cave lion was not adapted to other foods. Black and white lions A lion is an animal with many interesting features. One peculiarity concerns the coloration. Some classifications mention such varieties as the white lion and the black lion. But this is erroneous. While the lion with a dark or black mane is a real subspecies, animals with white or black coloration are considered an anomaly. At the same time, we cannot say that a lion with exotic coloration is a fiction. There is a genetic mutation called leucism. It causes the fur of animals to take on a white color. 
This occurs due to a lack of melanocytes. The result is the appearance of an animal such as the white lion. One might assume that it is an albino lion, but the color of its eyes, which can be either blue or golden, says otherwise. The white lion is almost indistinguishable in its characteristics from the rest of the species. It is somewhat larger than the others. Their weight can reach 310 kilograms, and the body length of the male exceeds 3 m. The females of these animals are slightly smaller 2.7 m. The white-coated lion changes color slightly during its life, and by old age its body acquires an ivory hue. A black lion, according to many scientists, does not exist in nature. Encountered in the network photos and videos of such animals, they believe the result of shooting in the dark or a special treatment. Some speculate that the counterbalance to albinism is the phenomenon of melanism, in which animals have too much pigment in their fur. This is possible in jaguars and leopards. Inbreeding may result in the birth of a lion with a darker shade of hair, but it is only by chance, so there is no need to single out such animals into a separate subspecies. Most of the subspecies of this animal is threatened with extinction, which is why it is kept in nature reserves. White-colored individuals are rare in part because it is much more difficult for them to adapt to environmental conditions. Their coloration prevents normal camouflage. These animals symbolize royalty, courage, majesty, power and strength in many cultures.